All right, here in my hand is a Tascam lav recorder. This is actually just the bag for it, but inside the bag, you should have a bunch of things. First thing being the lav recorder itself, which is like this, a recorder and a microphone with a clip and a little windscreen on the top. AAA battery that gets popped in the back. Close that sucker up. And then also on the side is where a 32 gigabyte micro SD card hangs out. You really shouldn't need to take this out, but I just wanted to show you where it is. There is a port for micro USB cable, which is what is in the bag right here. This is the microphone itself and the uh, windscreen just pops off like so. And I'm gonna let that down there. And then to get the microphone out, you just have to gently pinch this guy whoop, like so. And you can flip it around to go whoop, like so. And as long as that's held in place, that's good. And then the windscreen needs to come back on. <laughs> Pulling the switch towards you will just turn the recorder on and Pushing the switch away from you will just immediately start it recording. But before you do any of that, I would like you to do two things. Tap the menu button, and then if you scroll up or down, you get to two different choices. One is format SD card, and this will wipe everything that's on the card so that you are starting with a clean slate. You say yes, and it does the executing motion, and it is complete. And then you go up to and this is up or down, you go up to system init, which means system initialize. Press yes, 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 and now it's complete. The system has been set back to do everything that uh, a normal conversational voice would record. So I just get out of there and see how it says it's a square. Once I push this forward, it will become a circle. But let me first put this microphone on my on my body. Let's let's uh, let's see what that's like if I turn this shot. Hi. Ooh, that's not good. Hello. So, without having any knots or anything, you just kind of take your cable and you get rid of any knots you have, any twists or anything in the cable. You want it to be as clean as possible. And one is for the recording and one is for the... So that would be a perfect set lavalier for uh, an interview or what have you. If you want to, you could go up under the shirt or whatever. Right there is how you press record. Well, you just press this up like so. And you'll notice that square turn into a circle. And so that's me, my voice, I'm recording. Isn't that wonderful? And then to stop the recording, again, I'm going to take that switch and press up and that circle will become a square. And now we've done that. So now we've recorded something. I'm gonna go and turn this recorder off, which by pressing this back towards the hold, we'll turn it off and it goes off like so. We're gonna take this USB cable and stick it in and plug it into a computer and then we will transfer the audio file. It, you don't have to have it turned on, but all of a sudden all this business starts to happen. It's thinking. And what's gonna happen is it's gonna show up on your hard drive, but you have to tell it storage. And then you said select. And then the USB starts to do the dance between each other and then it actually shows up. Okay, so on your desktop is the DR-10L. You double click on that and lo and behold, what shows up is your files that you have recorded on the DR. What I would recommend you do is you click on your finder, you set up a new folder and then you name it and you say, hey test. So then you take your file and you throw it in the hey test. You open up hey test and look at that, there it is. This is your file. And you'll notice that square 
turn into a rectangle. And so that's me, my voice, I'm recording. Isn't that wonderful? And then to stop the recording, again, I'm going to take that switch and press up. So there you have it. When you're done, make sure you eject. If you're using a Mac, bonk, you can go ahead and unplug. And you'll notice it's reading, it's thinking. So you need to turn it off. So you have to pull that towards you and it will go off. And then you're not blowing any battery power. Isn't that lovely? There's the bag. There's the thing. Throw it all in. Just be gentle. Big important thing about the cables. Don't let any of this business get tied up in knots. It's sad. Gentle wind around three fingers will do the trick. Get that guy put away like so. And then it goes in like that. And you are a happy person. Thank you.